Hey, sneaking us back in the house. Yes, back in the house, back in the house, back in the house, back in the house. Yep, I'm back here, yeah, by the way. This is Elementary OS Beta. Okay, Beta, 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 Beta. 64 bit, by the way, 64 bit. I've installed it on the old banger machine because I'm just I'm still refurbing the old dual core. Well, this is like threaded, so we should get a little bit of a video out of it. So it's a hardware install. Yes, hardware, hard. It's so hard, it's a hardware install. So yeah, it's super duper. And it seems to run super fine, especially the 64 bit version. I'm getting more and more to like the 64 bit versions of stuff because they've started running better. Whereas a year and a half ago, two years ago, they were a bit poo on a stick, weren't they? They would just run away, if you know what I mean. They'd run away, like got the runs. So anyway, I'll go through it. Basically, this is called Pathanon, I think it's Pathanon or Pathanon, and it's like their own version of uh, what should we say? What is it? Come on, you know what it is. Come on, you know what it is. It's their own version of GNOME, of course it is. That's why it looks like this at the top. So of course at the top here, you've got the usual bar up here with see you later, me mail, me volume. I've got me intranet connection and the me that I put me on there. And you should do me something here. See, that's me. I'm there. Hello, me. I'm sneaky because it's full install. And I'm using record my desktop because it's not meaty enough to use double FMPEG machine. So I just thought I'd use this instead because it's all right. And down here we have like a little ducky bar going down, you know, a little ducky bar, which you can change the size of and stuff like that. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to have up settings just to show you a few things. Because some of the programs they've got in here, I wouldn't have actually chosen for it personally. But again, don't shoot me. I'm only the messenger. I'm just showing you, aren't I? Okay, so I've installed my NVIDIA driver, by the way, so it's all NVIDIA out. I'm NVIDIA, and that should work Uncle Dory. All that worked all right with the Nouveau, really, to be honest with you. It wasn't too bad at all. You can check out your displays, your keyboard, mouse, all stuff like that. It's all know me, innit? It's all a bit know me. Yeah, a bit know me. So you can check out your desktop. So if I click desktop, okay, here we can change how desktop pack around if you're so wish to do so. And as you can see, I've got a little shell thing going down. So I like shells, because you like, if you put them to your ear, they sound like a C. Shh. And stuff like that, I know. But yeah, you can change your desktop background here. If we go click on dock, you can check out your dock here. So we can make the dock bigger or smaller. So should we make the big, bigger, 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 bigger? We make the dock bigger. Okay. So we'll go to one, two, three, four, five, six. We'll make it fifty. You see, it gets a bit bigger. If we make it bigger, we go to sixty. Make it even bigger. Oh yeah. But we'll go down now. Go back to forty-eight. So it's nice and small. Okay, so that's that. And we've got the hot corners. So I've set some hot corners. So top left is open launcher. Bottom left is minimize my current window. Top right is expose all windows because it's an exposee. You know what I'm saying? And bottom right is maximize our current window. So yeah, that's all I can And you can go back to there as well and check out anything else that you want to do. So yeah, that's Hunky Dory, isn't it? Yeah, lovely. I like that. That was quite good, wasn't it? So anyway, as I was saying, I use one of my hot corners. I'll go out my corner. It's really hot. Feeling hot, hot, hot. As you can see, I've actually installed some programs in there because I just didn't like the ones that come with it. Notably, I'm not going to tell you yet. But anyway, it comes with Midori as standard. Now, it just doesn't work properly for me, Midori, on this system. It works on such systems and not others. It just doesn't work very good for me on this particular one. So I've installed Google Chrome. Yes, Chrome, not Chromium. And Firefox as well. I've also installed Asunder and Clementine. Because that's a better music player than noise. There's just not enough options for me in noise to use, and it won't bleed loud enough for a start. Because I like to blow my eardrums off, if you know what I mean. Of course, because I'm recording this at the same time, we're using Record My Desktop. Okay, I've not installed Abby, installed Abbey Word or anything because you actually get Scratch. Yeah, red ribbon. Scratch is a sort of word processor, sort of very, very simply one, very simple. Okay, it can be used. <clears throat> it's not my cup of tea, coffee, or anything else. But hey, if you like it, you can use it. So that's Hunky Dory, okay? So anyway, enough of that. I'm going to go down to my bottom bar just to show you some bits and bobs, okay? We get Maya for my calendar. We get Shotwell. Shotwell, when it decides to do that, okay? That's all right. Geary for your mail. Who's Geary? Is that, is that some bloke's name? Has he got, got a new application out? Yeah, I have actually heard of it, but yeah. You've got Geary for your mail, okay? Or Geary. Midori is the standard browser, okay? Fair enough. Your file system. Okay, Empathy is here also, yes, Empathy. I thought we got rid of that by now. The Software Center is here as well. Noise for Music, well, I'm gonna open it up for you just so you can see. It, it, I just, it, it's just too basic for me, to be honest. Yes, I know, I mean, I've, put, I've burned some stuff in here already, okay? But if I go to Settings and go to Preferences, there is just not enough for me to play with. It's just not whatsoever. I mean, I like lots of bits and bobs. Yeah, I know you can change your views like so. Look, I can change it to that. So it looks a bit like Rhythm Box. We'll go back to that one. Or I can have that view as well, but it's just, it's just not doing it for me whatsoever. 
So, of course, what did I do? Yeah. You know what I did, didn't you? You know exactly what I did. Went to my hot corner, and I went down to there, and I got Clementine. Now, I know it's not a native GTK application, okay? I know it isn't, so don't bang on to it about me, but it's better in the long run. And it seems to run rather nice here, okay? So if I just open up here, what's that? Activate here. Activate. And can you see what I mean? It's a lot more, you can do a lot more with it, basically. And if I go down to preferences here, right, okay? You see what I mean? I can change my playback behavior, I can change that behavior, my music library, my network proxy, my trends code, if I want to trends code it to go on my little portable generic MP3 player. I can choose what bit rate I want. I can even use my Wiimote. Yeah, no, I can use my Wiimote to play me stuff. Also, I can get Groove Shot, Magnitude, Last FM, and all the other stuff, and I'll get an equalizer, okay? And I get an equalizer, yeah. I get an equalizer, like I'll show you that. I can do whatever I like with it, you know what I mean? Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Peace out, yeah, you know what I'm saying, yeah. we will close that bit. Yeah, so that's one one thing I've changed about it personally, okay? I'm not certainly banging on about because it does run rather nice, or even though I'm not a, f a real, real fan of GNOME, okay? I just am not. I don't know why. I just don't. Maybe I've just not used it enough. Anyway, where was I? Yes, noise. We also got report a problem and your settings manager. Now, on the whole, it's nice, clean, fast for what it is, bearing in mind it's name free on this old banger of a machine. But personally, I would change quite a few of the programs. But apart from that, it's all, it's all right. Yeah, it's all right. So what I'm going to do, right, because I'm, you know, I just don't like it, I'm just going to change some of the applications here. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to drag down my Fearfox, okay, drag down down there, and I'm going to drag down my Clementine down there. Did it go down? No, I don't think it went down, did it? Let me try it again. That's better, we're in that time. And I'll get rid of that there. Go away, go away, go away. Oh, go I've got better. Okay, he's gone now. No, go away. Thank you. So I mean about name free, I'm just not into it. And I will remove Midori. So I don't want to keep it in the dock whatsoever. Will it go? Yes. I want to remove noise. I don't want to keep it in the dock. No, I don't. It's just not my cup of tea. They're some of the first things I would do to change it, okay? Uh, I would have Gimpy in it as well. Is Gimpy here? That's one thing I did look. I don't think even Gimpy is installed as such, to be honest with you. No, it's not. If you can download it yourself, why should I have to, basically? Why should I have to? Gimpy should be installed as standard. Even though, though, it does fit on a CD. It does fit on a CD. And it seems to record OK, although I did have some problems earlier, OK? So if I open up the software centre... Dun, dun, dun. It's going to take a little while now. Bearing in mind, this machine's old, right? I will start using the other machine next week, by the way. I'm, I'm just getting all the dust out of it and stuff like that, to be honest with you. It just needs a good overhaul, as you do when you live in a dusty house. Yes, not that I don't live rub, it's just a general dusty house. Anyway, the software centre is taking its time opening, and we'll wait a bit, we'll wait a bit. Okay. Mm. From here, you can download if you want, really. And if you really wanted to, you could install Synaptic via Terminal, couldn't you? If you wanted to, but we're not going to do that. But there is no, as we said, there's no actually office suite, so you can get LibreOffice. So if I put in LibreOffice here, I think that's how it's spelled. I'll probably spell it completely wrong. So we'll get with that. Okay, goodbye. We'll go to Office. Okay. And here we go. If you scroll down, LibreOffice was there. There it is, right there. We'll go to More Info. Wait for it to come open. Dun, 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 dun. And we'll scroll down a bit. Once it lets me, there's it loads and loads of add-ons for it. It's going to be a big old download, but it wants 136 to start with, okay? By the time you add all these extras, it's going to be more like 200 plus, okay? I'm not going to install it now, because I'm not going to use elementary OS as this standard on this desktop, okay? Well, on the whole, bearing in mind it's a beta, it runs reasonably smooth, but I would change some of the programs as default. Midori being the main one, and Noise being the other one, as I've just shown you, as I've just done. I'd also change empathy as well, personally. But apart from that, it's really, really nice. It's nice and clean. I do like the cleanness of it. It's really, really nice. Right, beta. I wouldn't normally do it, would I? Wouldn't normally give it. A, I wouldn't normally give it. A, no, I wouldn't normally. Would I? No, I wouldn't. But I'm going to give it a score. Yeah, you know, I'm going to score it as. I'm going to score it as 82. Ain't too bad. Need some bits using. But ain't my cup of tea. But you may like it. So if you like it, go and give it a download and give it a whiz. Hardware install only though, like this one. This is not in the box. No, 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 no. I was wanna you want me to show you, didn't you? Sorry, before we go sneaky links out, I'll quickly show you my fast system. Okay. There we go. 
I've also been using there's another there's a 250 gig uh, hard drive in this machine and it's a, a dual split here. So one's 123 and this is the other 123. So we're whooshing over the top. Yeah, whooshing over the top. Do you like whooshing over the top? Whoosh over the top. Yes, I'm liking. Lovely. Sneaky Linux going out. I'll see you later. Bye bye.